Hey, I'm Matt with WeBoost and I've been living out of this RV for two weeks. I'm gonna show you what's inside, what it's all about. Come on in. I rented this 29 foot Winnebago from Outdoorsy. It's kind of like the Airbnb for RVs. They were super easy to get and hold of, super easy to rent from, and I've really loved this RV. What's really unique is this big panorama driving area. Some really comfortable seats for a driver, for a passenger. You have a panoramic view of where you're driving, a lot of space to see outside the windows, and it's a pretty comfortable ride. Another big bonus is that we have two USB ports here. So when you, your spouse, or anyone else needs to charge phones or your devices, it's a really helpful spot to charge when you're on the road. What's special about this Winnebago is it has a drop-down bed. It's perfect for one adult, maybe two kids if you have small kids. It's really simple to use. It has a one clip, buckle clip right here. And with a simple push of a button, this entire bed lowers for a super comfortable space for somebody else to sleep. A really awesome feature of this Winnebago is this slide out. It gives you about four extra feet of interior space and it also features a dinette. Now this dinette is perfect for about four people. It'll fit four people comfortably, but a really cool feature is that this actually folds into a bed. So if you need a kid or an adult to sleep in this space, you have your overhead bed above the cab. Now this also turns into a bed. This table simply pops up, the legs come out and it lowers into the bed. A really great addition to our Winnebago is the WeBoost Drive 4GX RV. It's a perfect device that helps us stay connected when we're on the road. Another great feature of this Winnebago is the kitchen. It has just about everything you need minus a dishwasher, uh, dual sinks for clean dishes, dirty dishes, coffee maker, flat screen TV, a cutting board for all those veggies that you're gonna be cutting while you're making dinner, a full stove with three burners, we have a mini little oven for when you wanna make baked goods after dinner. And of course, a trusty microwave. Winnebago has designed a really smart space with tons of storage. So right above the sink here, we have plenty of space for glasses, bowls, jars, anything that you really need to put up there and keep safe from falling out or crashing and breaking. Uh, on the opposite side above the dinette is additional storage space. So maybe you wanna store clothes, or adventure sports activity equipment or anything you really need. These sliding doors are really easy to use. They click in, so when you're driving, they're not gonna open. This Winnebago also features a nice size fridge. It has a freezer and a fridge right below it. And of course, next to it, plenty of space for pantry items. So we're gonna continue onto the back of the RV, which features shower, bathroom, and bedroom. The back of this RV is really well designed. It features a bathroom separate from the shower while allowing this door to actually close and make a privacy space. So if you need to use a bathroom or someone needs a shower, you have your privacy while the people in the front of the RV can enjoy their time as well. When you're on the road, you're often living in smaller spaces, but Winnebago doesn't sacrifice the size of the shower. The shower is very large, enough for a full-size adult, turn around, wash up, even has shower head. The bathroom in this Winnebago has a large counter space and plenty of room behind the mirror for any of your toiletries. The back of this RV features a full-size bed that fits two adults comfortably, has plenty of closet space, mood lighting, and of course, a mini flat screen TV. Driving all around the Intermountain West is a little tiring, so I'm gonna take a nap. I need you guys to kind of head out so I could rest. See you later. Oh yeah, don't forget to subscribe to WeBoost's YouTube channel so you get more great content like this. See ya.